It's Friday morning. Let's go visit the crack pipe store. If you want to buy a crack pipe in Miami, this is a convenient place. We're on Commodore Plaza now. Let's have a breakfast. It's a really pretty area. You know, all of this is paid for with drug money. <clears throat> just like, oh, through 30 years ago. So we go down to the corner here and make a right. Might as well do this in real time. Make a right turn. And this is where the cops hang out. Hey, this is their, this is their little country club area. This is where, uh, Officer Crackpipe Torres, I call him, the one who's arrested me and Baker acted me, oh, about three times. This is where the cops oftentimes hang out. There won't be anybody here right now. But there. Pardon the bump. Let's do a quick stop. Need a crack pipe? Five dollars and fifty cents. And if they don't have any here, ask a Miami cop, okay? They're very friendly. Let's go see Commissioner Sarnoff's house, okay? That's only a, about, oh, a minute, a minute or two minute ride. So we're leaving the Quick Mart, and uh, I think we'll just go down here to 32nd Avenue. There are many ways to get there. Nice morning. It looks like I'm going to run a light. Gosh, I hope I don't get a ticket. We'll go see Commissioner Sarnoff's house and the dog park and the $200,000 traffic circle in front of his home. In the Navy, we used to say, rank has its privileges, but that's the way it works in the Miami. If you know people, you get things. Good things. You get positions of power and perks and jobs for your friends. All right, cut this off for a minute. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, Teresa. That's our commissioner's wife. Let's go back and see her. You know, my, my timing is my timing is really impeccable. Hi. Hi, Teresa. How are the dogs? Say hi to Mike for me, okay? Mark, Mark is probably missing me. Mark is probably missing me. I'm missing him. Yes. Have a nice day. Isn't that something? That's uh, Teresa Sarnoff. She's the, uh, the dear wife of my old buddy, Mark Sarnoff. Well, I, I'm the first person Mark Sarnoff ever met in Miami. We used to be pretty good friends. Then when I decided he's not a very nice person. And also he protects cops who try to kill people like me. He knows very well that I'm a cop beating survivor and I've been arrested a number of times for blowing the whistle on cocaine cop activity here in Miami. Let's go see the commissioner's house. Just so if you're ever a tourist in Miami, you can see what it looks like. It's really nice. It's two houses, two houses together. And there's a dog park. Yes, pardon the sunshine and pardon the wind noise. Uh, Mark had this park made and put in front of his house at great public expense. This is a little park for kids to play in. And then adjacent is, uh, is the famous, the infamous. It's very nice. Everybody likes it. The dog park. Blanche Park. And this is where you can come and walk your dog. And, and it smells like doggy poo here, naturally. And here, this double compound, this is a... Uh, this is the commissioner's home and his office. 
One is his home and one is his office. And I've, I've come here many times over the years. I used to be friendly with Mark. Now we're sort of in conflict. But I see he still has his Bernese dogs, trophy dogs. Gee, I wonder, I wonder if he's home. I'll ring the doorbell. I hope they have a... Good morning, Mark. It's your old pal, Reed. All right, let's go to the, let's go to the Home Depot and get some propane for my glass blowing exercises. Over and out. Have a nice day, Commissioner Sarnoff. I'll see you on the 19th at that city commission meeting. I hope it's not going to be any bad surprises for me. I've seen enough bad surprises.